We are going to look at our SAP certified cloud enabled AuditBot tool for SAP risk analysis. Our GRC tools for SAP are Master Data Analyzer, System Log Analyzer, Emergency Access Management, Process Controls, License Saver, and SAP Risk Analyzer. Why do you need risk analysis? You can save money on your compliance cost. Save time by really getting notified as risks happen in the SAP system. Everything can be automated so there is less manual labor used for identifying the SAP risks. We have pre-delivered rule set which can be easily customized. The solutions is completely ABAP based, quick to install and quick to implement. Our SAP risk reports can be up and running in hours. Here are some of the sample clients we have currently using our tools, and the notable ones are Deloitte Mexico, Corona Beer, Mead Johnson, PNG, Diakin America. Cloud-enabled AuditBot SAP risk analysis tool collects the following information from your system. Table logs, transaction executed logs, transaction assigned, and document postings. This information will be used for you to give a comprehensive look at your SAP risks based on transaction assignment, transaction executed, and data changes made in the SAP system. Here is a summary level SAP risk report from our system. Now we are showing the detailed report at the authorization object level. We also go into the authorization object level for the SAP risk analysis. Here is the SAP risk simulation and mitigation controls. We can apply mitigation controls at the user level or role level. This SAP risk analysis report is based on table postings. We also show you exactly what tables was modified due to the SAP risk in the system. Now we are showing the SAP Risk Simulation Report, where we can also simulate based on authorization field level. We are now into SAP Certified AuditBot Tool, and will show you an SAP Risk Analysis Report. Here is a user level risk analysis report, and we have three options. You can run the report based on SAP SOD risks, or sensitive access risk, or sensitive object level. We are going to run the user level SAP risk report. I am sorting the list by number of unique users. Here we have 189 people who have the SAP SOD risk. Purchase unauthorized items and hide by not fully receiving the order. I can double click on this line and then I can see the number of users who are having that particular SAP SOD risk. We are able to see the users who have the SAP SOD risk. The red indicator means that the SAP SOD risk has been executed. You can also see the number of SAP SOD risks, number of SAP SOD risks within the SAP roles, number of transactions assigned. We can double click on each line to see a business view, which means I just want to see which transactions which are conflicting. In this case, the MB01 is conflicting with ME21, ME21N, ME22, ME22N. Now I am pulling up the SAP SOD risk execution report. Here we can see whether this risk has been executed and what transaction has been executed. We can see here on one side MB01 MIGO has been executed and the other side ME21 ME21N has been used. We can also show you the table postings and any table changes which have been made using these transactions. We can also show you a technical view, which shows the SAP SOD risk at the authorization object level. 
Now, we are showing the risk at the object level where we see that the MB01 on one side, ME21 on the other side. You can also see all the SAP authorization objects and all the SAP roles, which are contributing to the SAP SOD risk. We are SAP Partner and SAP Certified. We provide a 30-day proof of concept installation, which can be done in one day and open to customization based on your requirements. Please email info at auditbots.com for proof of concept installation.